Welcome back to the Cloud Diaper Podcast. Today I am rummaging in my pockets bin because it's been a while since we've had some reviews on pockets. Sometimes pocket diapers can feel a little bit mundane to talk about because they're kind of all the same, but they're also not. The pocket that I'm gonna pull out today that we're gonna talk about is the Earth and Pebble pocket diaper. Now this diaper is made by Canadian Mama. It is manufactured overseas and I've written a review on it over at the Cloth Diaper Podcast. So we're just gonna take a look at some of the features in this diaper and who this diaper is for. If you're new here, my name is Bailey. I host the Cloth Diaper Podcast and I've been educating and advocating for cloth diapers for over six years now. I've been working with brands, retailers, and parents around the world and my kids are no longer in diapers. So this is less of a review from my experience and more of just an opportunity to show you through video a great new product and provide you with some updates about why it might be one for you. You can learn more about Brittany and her brand Earth and Pebble on the Cloth Diaper Podcast. A show was released, I think, December 2021. So check that out and we'll go check out her diaper over at the table. And here it is. This is a one size diaper. It's about seven to 35 pounds. It features four rise settings for that adjustability, double waist, crossover, top hip snap. And inside we have a pretty classic pocket diaper. Classic pocket because here we are, we're gonna compare it to another pocket. So Kinder Cloth is another pocket that emerged on the scene. And as you can see, very similar shape and cut. There's not, there's nothing really super unique about the Earth and Pebble. And you know what, that's okay. Not every diaper needs to be crazy daisy unique and have something functional about it. At the end of the day, a lot of these standard pockets are all the same. It's got microsoid, it's got a curved tummy panel and a back open pocket. In this diaper today, I have a microfiber insert, but the Earth and Pebble diaper system is sold without inserts. It's a shell system, so you can choose whatever insert you want. I've pulled open the diaper because sometimes this is kind of interesting to see. It's a PUL waterproof outer layer, a suede inner, and just that beautiful classic shape. Everybody seems to really love this rainbow print, and I think that Brittany ha is launching some new designs, some new collabs coming up this year. So be sure to go find Earth and Pebble on Facebook and subscribe to this show because I will definitely let you know as soon as I know I'm folding this diaper up because I love to show you how small this diaper gets. Many pockets get nice and tiny. They give these little itty bitty leg holes and can really be adjusted to fit and work with whatever you want. One of the biggest reasons I decided to start a podcast was I wanted to understand the truth behind cloth diaper brands. What was going on? Were people really just remaking Alpha over and over again and throwing their own label on it? And in some ways, yes, they are. But in a lot of ways, people are making small changes to products, putting out their own prints, bringing their own customer service to the industry, and finding ways to better that cookie cutter cloth diaper experience for you, the consumer. So. While this Earth and Pebble pocket diaper is not revolutionary in its design and construction, what it is, is bringing the cloth diaper community to Canada and creating more spaces for education, information, and successful cloth diapering. Brittany is fantastic. She's phenomenal. She's a wonderful soul. And she brings me so much excitement. I know that she's sold out in her line. And what I love most about this product is not the product itself, but the experience. And that when you purchase an earth and pebble diaper, you're, you're not just purchasing a cloth diaper, you're purchasing a brand, you're purchasing experience, you're purchasing more, which that sounds all hokey. I mean, I would not be one to be drawn to this product because micro suede gives me the heebie-jeebies and I'm not a huge fan of pocket diapers, but the construction is built. It's well designed and I trust in the owner. And sometimes that's all you need in life. It has all of my favorite essential features of a pocket diaper, the tummy panel, the double waist snap, the PUL has a good amount of give and weight to it. The weight is important because you don't want it to be super thin. Otherwise it's gonna kind of like plop out on you. I'm really excited for what she brings next to the industry. You can listen to Brittany's story on the Cloth Diaper podcast. She shared about the starting of 
her brand and I know that with her next release of products she'll be making changes that she needs to to ensure that her product continues to meet your needs as a customer and when we're looking at pockets like this one buy the buy the diapers that are pretty buy the diapers that support you buy the diapers that give you joy and two buy the products that are willing to adapt and grow with you as a cloth diaper parent in this industry because we really need that we do we need this continual evolution of tweaking and changing of products to ensure that they are the best possible products so that we can be set up to succeed and i know that sounds a little hoggy and it sounds kind of like of course you would say that bailey you're a blogger but there are so many products being pumped out that are just mediocre and setting people up for failure that when I get a product that is for success, it is. And you might gawk at the price, <sighs> but the price is the price because that is the price of doing business in Canada. Uh, we have been accustomed to this idea that we have to get everything for dirt cheap. But by the time you make the changes you need to do, you custom order the product, you set up a business, you provide and support parents, it's going to have a cost. And as an industry, we need to be okay with that cost and we can't be calling it out all the time. This is what a product costs. And if you're not here for that product to cost that, then move along. Everybody deserves a livable wage in this industry and the constant, your product needs to be cheaper, your product needs to be cheaper dialogue that we kind of go into is damaging. I think this product is fairly priced for what it is. You can mix and match whatever insert that you want. You can get the support you need from Brittany. You can purchase these on Amazon. You can customize it the way that you need it. And she's got lots of other great products and accessories to ensure that you have a cloth diapering success. I think this is a fantastic product for beginners. I think this is a fantastic product for people who are needing diapers for caregivers, for daycare, for anxious grandparents. The top hip snap is one of my favorites and you definitely need to check out the Earth and Pebble brand. You definitely need to check out the Earth and Pebble brand. Until next time, I'll see you on the internet.